Hi everyone, today we continue to develop our browser online game and uh, I did several changes. So I created uh, several tables for fleets and uh, I add some logic for creating fleets. Uh, which table I created? So I created, of course, um, table fleets. Uh, it has relations to city ID, target city ID, and fleet task ID. And I have several parameters like speed, gold, recursive. Gold it means that how much uh, how much money fleet can carry. Recursive means that yeah, uh, we will repeat our task um, forever uh, before we cancel it. So time it's time and deadline it's yeah, it's deadline, nothing special. So fleet uh, fleet task dictionary. It's small table with three fields, four four fields. Yep, uh, and uh, yeah, we just have title, description, and Slack. And of course, we have fleet details. Fleet details contain uh, type of worships which we have in each fleet. So, for example, we have fleet, which can, uh, which includes, I don't know, free, free warships, and free trade ships. I don't know, something like this. So, and of course, we have relation to warship ID. Okay, and of course, I created, of course, I created Cedar, and I use it. And I just add some um, some tasks, and of course I create some fleet status dictionary. Uh, it will be useful later when we will proceed our fleet. Yep. For example, if say trade fleet to to some island, uh, firstly it will be fleet will have status on on way after that status will be trading and after that status will be i don't know on way back in the future in this table we will create more statuses for each type of tasks and for each fleet okay uh, and of course uh, i add some logic for sending fleet but i don't i didn't didn't complete it I didn't complete it. So and today we will we will try to complete it. So I add action send. Yep. And I can choose, for example, I don't know. Uh, so I don't have any ships right now, but I need to um, update my table. OK, so right now I have three uh, warships and two warships of ship two and OK. And I can send, for example, two warships of ship one and one warship of ship two. And I can set, for example, coordinates five and five. And I will use, I will select trade task and recursive. Okay. And when I send it, I need to send my fleet. So if I press the button, I send all my parameters with fleet details yep and i have nothing in in response so uh, i created fleet controller yeah with send function so this function just call special fleet service and method send i give request and user parameters uh, for this method so in this function send I just use my parameters. I just check target city. And if I have no city, no target city, I just return that there is no city. And if I, for example, somehow chose mm, incorrect task type, so I return error of task type. After that, I, I found my task type ID and check some details of fleet. Because, for example, I can send five warships if I have just one or two. So, 
uh, I just check user information, user CT info, yep, and worships in my in users city. After that, I check all worships and in fleet details and just create new variable updated fleet details, uh, which which has correct information about fleets, about warships. And if I have no warships in the end, so I just return error that I have no warships. After that, I need to calculate gold for sending fleet because I think that it will be not not free. You need to pay something to send fleet to somewhere. Yeah, but we will do it later. And I calculate the distance. It just um, I just called ABS function with uh, coordinates, nothing nothing interesting. And after that, I just found time to target. I just um, multiply distance by five. So in the end, we will change it to, because we need to add speed parameter for it, but I don't know. I, right now, I don't have, um, you know, formula for it. We need to create it later. And of course, right now we need to create fleet and fleet details. So. We will do it here, and I will call fleet uh, method create. Yep. And what I need here, I think that I need uh, I need city ID which is my city user city ID. I think I need target city ID which is target city ID. What else I need? I need fleet task ID. I said fleet task ID. It's task type ID. Speed is just constant 100. Later we will change it. Time is time to target. Gold right now at zero. Recursive, it's just a flag from our page, and deadline is just I just call carbon function and add time to target in seconds. So, and of course, I need to get fleet ID, so it's fleet ID because I need to create fleet details and I need to set relation to fleet. So, here I need to create fleet details. I just watch uh, updated fleet details as fleet detail, and I just create fleet details with parameters fleet ID, uh, which I had, which I got earlier. Yep, and worship ID and QT. Nothing special. And of course, after that, I need to remove worships from from city because these worships, you know you are sent to some island and of course i need to remove it from city how will i do it i will just um, use worships with special you know conditions like worship id and i will get for first row and after that i will just increment negative negative uh, amount of worships so, and I think that it should work. So we can, we can check it right now, I think. So I will open fleet and I have two fleets. Okay. And about fleet details, I have five fleet details. So, and right now I will add, I will create new fleet. Yep. And I will check what I, what I have. So, okay, I sent my request. I have no errors and fleets. Yep, I have third fleet. Uh, target ID, uh, fleet task ID, speed, goal, to okay, recursive. I have some time and deadline. So it looks correctly. And what about details? Yep, I have uh, two rows of fleet details and I have third fleet ID and warships. Yep. I chose three warships of warship ID one and two of two. 
yeah it looks yeah it looks correctly so and right now right now if i for example send again my fleet so i i will got an error mm. no i didn't get an error but yeah of course i uh, i don't have new new fleet because i don't have enough warships so i i think that we'll improve it later of course and right now i think that uh, it's enough for today and thank you for watching if you like this video please subscribe my channel leave some comments if you have something to say press like button it's very important for me it shows that you are interested in this game so thank you for watching again see you in the next video bye